So we were in Kenya five, six years ago, and really during that time felt the call to adopt. Okay, you ready? Yeah! Remember we went to an event, they said there were 600 children in Colorado that day that needed a home. It was their third foster home and we just felt called it was these kids. You guys not like my art and music mornings? I do. Okay. I do, yeah. They hadn't had a, a solid upbringing so... Just needed love and boundaries. And as new parents to them, we were like, what can we do to give them the best start, to help them catch up? and we've been learning more about the gut-brain connection. We're just so fascinated that we could focus on this area of health and that it would affect our mental well-being. Mentally, one of the first things I felt was just that clarity of mind. Everyone says this is just called mom brain when you're busy with the little kids and it's just normal. No, it's not normal. It's okay if you're there, but we, we can help with that. Janelle's ability to handle stress went through the roof. The things that would cause her to crack before, she handled. When we saw Amari and what we'd been studying, and it was like, this is an answer that nobody's got. This is the missing link for a lot of people. But this is one thing we can help in nurturing them with making sure their bodies were as healthy as possible and helping them to understand this connection between the gut and the brain and be aware of their own mental well-being as well as their physical well-being. So let's take a look here as we come on for this week, West, actually Western European countries. Who doesn't like happier? You know, more joyful children. And then for us to be happy and more joyful parents, you know, it just builds mm -hmm. the family relationship so much more. I think that servant leader is thinking about their needs. This is not about us or even frankly a rank. We see the potential in each person. And so how can we help them to see that in themselves? And I think Amari's given us the ability to dream a lot, lot bigger about making a difference in the world for kids. We get to grow from our heart and we get to become even more. And if people can just latch on to the timing is now, not in three years, not in five years, if you really want to make a massive difference and be part of something when it's starting, now is the time. This month, don't wait, just dive in, go all in.